Here is your quick 62nd August 23 real estate market update in San Diego. The median sales price, we're at 875,000. So last month we were at 865. So we have risen 10K in just one month. And then last year we're at 830,000. Now last year, there's a six month stretch that started just a couple months ago, like the back half of 2022, where we went into a decline. But since January of 2023, our median sales price has continually increased each month. I'll show a graph to illustrate that. As of August 10th, the 30-year fixed rate mortgage average in the US is 6.96%, almost seven. That is the highest since 2002 in the last 21 years. The total homes for sale is at 4,091. That's down 23% year over year. But the new listings, which are homes that have hit the market recently within the last 30 days, that's down 40% from this time last year. So that tells us that more and more people are holding on to their low rates that they've been locked in at for the past few years from purchasing, and that more of our total inventory of that 4,000 number is actually becoming stale and has been sitting on the market for a bit. On average, homes are going into contract 1% higher than the original list price where they come to market. The month supply of inventory is the highest we've seen since March of 2020, but it's still at only 2.1 months supply. So that tells us at the moment that we are still in a seller's market. The affordability is the lowest it's been ever <laughs> since I've seen on a graph. It's at uh, 31. Now something else, you have to remember that cyclically, this is typically the hottest time of the year. So while we're in a tough market right now, it's still competitive. Inventory is still very low and the median sales price is still rising. I personally just received multiple offers on one of my listings yesterday. That is the first weekend on market. And I'm hearing the same from other agents as well if the homes are a typically turnkey, price right, move-in ready, ready to go.